Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a Patreon poll pick, and the uh like theme was blow stuff up. That was the theme, and what they picked was the movie 2012. Uh, I do not know anything about this movie as uh, how most of this channel works. I was alive during 2012, so I think that's going to be helpful. But <laughs> is it literally just about the year 2012? Because that would be really weird. I don't think I've seen a movie about that. That'd be kind of cool, though. You could start a whole series. 2013, 14, 15, you know. <laughs> Did anything major happen in 2012 that I don't... Oh. No, I mean, but... I... Wow. I don't know. Uh, if you don't know who I am, my name is James. I am an ex-Iowa farmer who grew up in the middle of nowhere and only had three channels on my TV, so we just didn't watch it. I became a massive bookworm and have been for over 30 years. And... I cared about books, novels, fiction. I, I read mostly fiction, not so much. A few nonfiction here and there. But uh, <clears throat> I cared more about books than I did about actors and movies. And, you know, I just I didn't get it. And so my oldest children convinced me to start this channel and start catching up on all these awesome U.S. movies I've been missing. And boy, are they right. We've been going strong for a couple of years now. Uh, we're trying to get to 25,000 subscribers, so make sure you are subscribed to the channel and follow me on this journey as I figure out who all these actors are, what their works, what the scope of work they've done is, you know, all this stuff I've been missing. It just, it's crazy. <laughs> and not just movies. I have a shows channel now. So it's a youtube.com slash at awesome shows. I'll link it below. Uh, so yeah, I have a whole channel for shows now. I'm 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 doing Breaking Bad, the entire series over there. Um, True Detective season one, and probably uh, Good Place is over there, and then eventually Sopranos will be over there. But uh, yeah, so <laughs> there's a lot going on over here on this side of the world. How about you? Are you doing okay? Good. Let's watch a movie together. How about that? Uh, let's watch 2012. This is a longer movie, 237. Is this a space movie? Solar flares. Welcome, my friend. <laughs> Great to see you. Yes. You're mysterious on the phone. Why didn't you attend the conference? I will show you, Agent Sir. What are we doing? We're going down. How deep do we need to go? 11,000 feet. 11,000 feet? You've come on a good day, my friend. Sometimes it can hit 120 degrees. What? It's supposed to get colder. So, what are we looking at? The biggest sun eruptions in human history. My God. It's big solar flare. The neutrinos are causing a physical reaction. That's impossible. It looks like the neutrinos coming from the sun have mutated into a new kind of nuclear particle. They're heating up the Earth's core. Oh, that's not good. I work for the White House. I don't care who you are, sir. This is a black tie event. Hey! I gotta speak to Anne House. I don't wanna get... Give me a damn jacket, okay. please. Oh. <laughs> Mr. Anheuser. Right there. Do I know you? Sorry, sir. My name is Dr. Adrian Helmsley. I'm... Who, who is he? It's extremely important, sir. You know what? It always is. Here's what I want you to do. Make an appointment with my... You know, even better, have your boss bring it up at the quarterly science briefing. Oh, jeez. You need to read it now. Let me guess. National Geology Crisis? <laughs> is he's obviously a scientist of some kind? Who do you report to? Lee Cavazos. Not anymore. Oh. Now you're gonna wish you took a shower. Sir? You're about to meet the president. Oh! Oh, goodness. We're getting nutty already. G8 Summit, 2010. It's been a year already. Oh. Good morning. I know him. He's from Lethal Weapon. A private G8 Summit meeting. I was made aware of a situation so devastating that at first I refused to believe it. The world as we know it will soon come to an end. Bet now. Man, we're getting around. 
全能小汉。Whoa. Okay. We're doing some blasting. It's already 2011. We're really getting places fast. Has His Highness had an opportunity to study the dossier? You must understand I have a very big family, Mr. Isaacs. One billion dollars is a lot of money. A billion euros. Yeah, all the governments are working together and starting to uh, take the good stuff. Enfin, elle sera désormais en sécurité. Tucked away in some bunker in Switzerland. So are we jump to 2012 now? I apologize if I'm a little throaty. I'm getting over COVID still. Mayan quiche calendar, which predicts the end of time to... Ugh, mass suicide discovered. For the biggest solar climate. Oh, earthquakes, California. Oh, it's John. John Cusack. I'm a dead man. Uh, I saw him a hot tub time machine and gross point blank. Yes, I'm hurling towards you as we speak. Oh, yeah, he has two cars? Oh, man. Would you look at that? That's a big crack. Meryl, I told you, we have to move back to Wisconsin. Yeah. Many quick story and want to share yes. Colby's and Randy. And... How late is he? How are you, sweetie? Good. Uh, taking them camping in a limo? What happened to your temp chart? Oh, you know, better hours, more time to write. You tell him. What? Tell him. She needs to put these on every night before she goes to sleep. We've really been looking forward to spending some time with you. I know. So don't be on your computer the whole time. Got it. Got it. So this Where are we at now? We hit Japan. So. San Francisco. I know that one building with the spike on the top. I've been there. You see your boy? Not as much as I'd like. DC is a long way, but at least we talk. About what? Life. Yeah, life. Oh, going up. Oh, that's a big wave. What the hell was that? <laughs> a little, little bit of a wave. Uh -huh. Oh, it's not in the Alps. Oh, it's not in the Alps. Oh, it's not in the Alps. Oh, it's not the Alps. Oh, it's not in the Alps. in the back he's got a psp back there government people what is that flying noise? in and out helicopter all and the what the hell three of them always what are the odds <laughs> doctor the seismic English. activity in the west coast is not caused by tic by regular earthquakes and these so-called surface cracks have nothing to do with shifting fault lines we situation been following the schedule you established oh yeah and now you're telling me we have to throw it out i was wrong is they coming quicker did you see this we are learning more about this deadly car explosion. Coincidentally, his death took place in the same Paris tunnel where Princess Diana died in 19... Oh, why is she so upset about this? It looks just like your mother when you get upset. Oh. Daddy, a man oh. was killed. Has he not told her? Please sit down. The Any S is going to hit the F. Anything in Paris, we're not, we're not involved in any of that, are we? We? Who the hell is we? What are you talking... Right. <laughs> they need to know. Your job is to figure out when this is all going to fall apart. My job is to figure out how to retain some type of government after it falls apart. Now, you call me the moment you get any news from Yellowstone. Cute girl, huh? I wasn't looking at it. Better move fast, kid. The end is near. Oh! <laughs> There's always got to be a love interest. Actually, it's a place where your mom and I used to hang out a lot. At least they're on a designated hiking trail. They're just not randomly going places. Oh! Don't you see the signs? There used to be a lake here. Oh, damn, thing's gone. Come on, let's check it out. Don't you notice the smoking behind you? Oh, boy. I would be anywhere near this. I'd be like, yeah, maybe jump over the fence. Okay, I get it, but not doing what you're doing. Ah. Uh, Military. It's the U.S. Army. And all manner of government vehicle are converted. Oh, my God, it's Woody Harrelson. We need you and your family to come with us. Right. That'll be fun, huh? Uh huh. He knows he's a deep crap. Uh, that's a big drill. They've arrested a group of tourists in the hot zone. What's going on here? We're geologists. So what happened to the lake? Well, that's what we're trying to find out. You're not by any chance the Jackson Curtis wrote Farewell Atlantis, are you? It's the very same. <laughs> so he read his book. Do you really believe those people would behave so selflessly knowing that their own lives were at stake? 
I hope so. Major, could you escort these good people to the campgrounds, please? He's just saying that because he liked my book. He was nice. What do you mean? My colleagues in Argentina and Ontario have almost identical data. I wish we were wrong, but the Earth's crust is destabilizing. It's too early. Yeah, that's not good. The Mayans saw this coming thousands of years ago. I thought we'd have more time. Wait, wait, what did the government guys say to you? They don't like us going over their fences. They said unstable. Yeah, unstable. <laughs> yeah. Woody's being creepy. Are you absolutely sure about this, Adrian? Because once we give these orders, there's no going back. We have to save what we can. We have to save what we can. That one, it was a big lake that was there before. Who gave you this, mommy? No, Gordon gave it to me for my birthday. Oh, he's got his own cell phone. What family? It hurts my feelings when you say stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> what is your question? I wanted to know, where is all this going to... It's Woody! Porting live from Yellowstone National Park, soon to become the world's largest active volcano. I'll be right back. Oh, that's true. There's a super volcano underneath the Yellowstone, that's true. What exactly is it that's gonna start in Hollywood? End of days, the judgment day, the beer? Yeah. The Mayan people were the first civilization to discover- Yeah! <laughs> oh, not again. Creamy. Oh, not again. <laughs> that is sort of funny. Nobody could keep that big a secret, Charlie. Well, like these guys. Boom! Boom! Every one of these guys dead! Well, that's, 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 that's Professor Myers. He was one of my most avid uh, listeners. Uh, Even sent me a map. They're building spaceships, man. The guy said that he was they were going on a big ship. Oh, that'll be all right. But anyway, I really enjoyed most of this. Thank you. So he took it. It's beer. Why don't we make a baby? We're not making a baby in the supermarket. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh. There's something pulling us apart. Oh, yeah. You have the, my ass don't let go. Run around the corner and run away. Which was open for business at the time, but Whoa. fortunately... Whoa. Holy crap, hurt. that's a big <laughs> hole. <laughs> She wants us to come home. We can save over 400,000 people. 100,000 people in each, quote, arc? We've observed extreme polar instability. How much time do we have to... Two, maybe three days, if we're lucky. Three days? I recommend we evacuate immediately. If any of you have objections, please speak now. I think it's funny that they all had bio computers, which is a Sony product, and this is a Sony movie. I thought that's... Little ad placement there. <laughs> uh, let's get ready to rumble! <laughs> Start boarding procedure. Oh! His son just got knocked out. So these people are paying like a billion dollars to get on these arcs. Okay, guys. Hey, buddy boy. Break your heart, man. Thanks for bringing them home early. Yeah. Curtis. Yeah. Get my boys as fast as you can. Oh, I'm hurling towards you as we speak, sir. Fancy house. Dang. Curtis, you're late. Good morning to you, too. Ow! Oh, he did that on purpose. Now you're laughing, Curtis. But we have tickets to go on a big ship. We will live and you will die. Curtis. Big ship. Did you hear that? The authorities in a- He can still hear him in LA? Are you a pilot? Yeah. I want to rent it, okay? I'll give you anything you want. Where are you going to go? I've rented a plane. Pack up the kids. Oh, yes. I'm going to be there in five plane? minutes. What are you Kate, California is going down. God, you sound like a crazy person. You call me back when you calm down. Oh, jeez. Oh, That's a big earthquake. Oh, Holy God. crap. Yeah, go outside. Outside is better. The house is going down. My hats. Oh, there goes the door. Oh, jeez, that's bad. Woo! Dang! Yeah, he's not crazy now, is he? Come on, yo bags! Whoa! Nice jump. Oh, Randy's donuts. 
Oh, last time to go. Go across. Go. <laughs> That's quite funny. It doesn't go down that slow. It goes really fast. That huge canyon that wasn't there this morning. San Andreas fault is shifting. The whole Pacific plate. Why aren't you heading towards the like ship? Um, he's dead. Who's that? Our pilot. Gordon, you can fly. No, no, I've only had a couple of lessons in a single engine plane only. Uh, you're the guy now. <laughs> It's like, have you played Flight Simulator? You're the guy now. <laughs> uh, Jackson? Oh, wow. Okay. Go higher. Go higher up. Yeah, higher up. Way higher up. Not, no, not lateral. Up. Yeah, there's people dying everywhere. Oh, that's a train. See, this is why you got to go up. He's going to fly between them. At least he's going up now. <laughs> it's not just California. It's the whole goddamn world is going to <laughs> Yellowstone. This crazy guy, but he's been right about everything that's happened so far. Yeah, huh? Guys, look. Oh, California is dropping into the ocean. We all knew it was going to happen one day. There we go. Cruise ship. There's a call for you, Harry. Dad. Adrian. Oh. It's happening, Dad. Probably shoot me if they knew that I told you. The president has ordered us to clear out the White House. It's about time somebody cleaned up that mess. <laughs> Don't you be worrying about your old man now. Basically, this is you the know, goodbye uh, call. We had one hell of a great life, son. And the best part about that is it's we you. had one hell of a great kid, too. Yeah. The Genesis. It's a pretty big ship, son. So don't you write your old man off. Just yet. I love you, Dad. I love you too, son. Oh, Where are you gonna land? Oh, that's not a bad, well, that's a horrible landing. Fill it up, I'm gonna go find Charlie. Daddy, wait, I wanna come with you. No, Jackson, hurry, please. Uh, you should not take her. Charlie! He's gotta be around here somewhere. Daddy, Daddy, oh, over there. Space. Good job, Lily, good job. Jackson, bring back my child now. Yeah, I'm good. Actually, it's good that she took him because they would have taken off without him. Where are the spaceships? There's no way you can make it there. We have a plane. You can come with us, but we got to leave right now. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> oh, you're a nutcase, Woody. Focus. Where's the map? Yeah. Uh, Where? It's in the camper. Where in the camper? In the map section map. on the conspiracy shelf Dewey Decimal System. What's happening? Yeah! Just grab him and go! Good luck. The last day of the United States of America! Uh, I think this is bigger than just the United States. <laughs> that guy's crazy, right, Daddy? Yes. So. No, he's, he's a little bit crazy. It's been over half an hour. I told you, the guy's a nut job. Stop. You're alive because of the nut job. Just the blast from that would kill all the people. Yeah, huh. You would have to be like 50 miles away from it. Oh. He's dead. Instantly. Bye, Woody. You're alive. Oh. You heard it first from Charlie! Okay, now Woody's dead. <laughs> Oh, there goes the back of it. Did they see him? There they are. Oh! Jumping. Yeah, the RV. Good job. Okay. Uh, hurry up. Roswell. And no, no. Just grab them all. Okay. Time to go. Yeah, he's not waiting. Wait, Gordon, I see something! Ah, okay, he's coming. Yeah, just run your ass off, dude. There we go. Oh, we got the map. Okay. Now pray you're not going to get hit by flying debris. Oh, that thing would be destroyed. Okay, good. We're out of it. Now that you got your map, where are we going? China. We're going to need a bigger plane. Uh-huh. We received this video from Globo News Brazil. Oh, 
Demanding a lift of the information blackout posed by the Oh geez, that horse just took somebody out. Kind of galling when you realize that nutbags with the cardboard signs had it right the whole time. <laughs> That's a good line. Just want to tell everyone they're doomed. Our mission is to assure the continuity of our species. The Yellowstone Caldera has erupted, sir. The ash cloud will reach Washington in roughly seven hours. <sighs> oh. We've got to get the government airborne. Yeah, huh? We gotta get the government airborne. Did you ever meet my wife, Dorothy? Oh, no, yeah, sir. he's still thinking about his wife. I didn't have that honor. She told me, I think you should have a lottery. Everyone should have a chance to go. Maybe that's what we should have done. A lottery system. I think people have a right to know. You get on that plane, son. The President of the United States isn't getting on the plane? They're in Vegas. How the hell are we going to make it to China, huh? Hey, Gordon, without Jackson, we wouldn't even made it out of California. He's right. Oh, look who it is. Yo! That's a big plane. President's not coming. That's his choice. And a noble one. Who is he? What about the Speaker of the House? In this chaos, I have no idea. Where is he? He's the Commander-in-Chief now, sir. Tell the Captain we're taking off. Sir, you don't have the authority. You couldn't even keep your goddamn mouth shut. You betrayed top secret information last year. Could have had us all killed. What the hell? Oh, they knew about it. What did you think? We're all just gonna get on board, hold hands, and sing kumbaya? Sit down and buckle up. He's not wrong. Oh, the daughter's there. The president's on the line, Dr. Wilson. Where are you? You never would have gotten on that plane if I told you. Why? Why wouldn't you get on the plane? Families can say goodbye to each other. A mother can comfort her children. And a father can ask his daughter for forgiveness. All you had to do was get on the plane. You could do whatever telecommunications with the nation you wanted to there. I wish I, I could tell you we, we can prevent the coming destruction. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall. Oh! Sharp off! We need help. Yuri! You got a plane? Of course. I found the Supreme. I need co pilot. Yo. Gordon, the pilot? I'm not. Yes, he yeah, is. He is. Great pilot. Let's go. Good. Let's go. Honey. Yo, let's go. <laughs> that's wow, a big plane. That's a big plane. Yeah. Why? We have VIP tickets for this. That's fantastic. Let's go. What the hell are you doing? Shut down immediately. Yeah, no, screw that. We're leaving. Oh, crap. Yeah, you got to go up. That's a big plane. Get rid of all those stupid cars. Take over. Take over. What do you mean? Take over. God, Yo. God. Jesus. Lift your big ass for Sasha. Lift your big ass for Sasha. <laughs> Get rid of the cars. There goes Vegas. We are on our way to China. That is good, huh? They don't have better seats on that massive plane for those people? <laughs> That's a long flight. Rinpoche took la care gonkido. Let's have some tea and think about it. Taluk sa mingdu. Tuk. Chirang kayudin ng shin. You're full of opinions. Yekin dis lam tun chikur. Sup sup chitang ah. Be careful with the clutch. It's a car. Oh yeah. He can get on the ship, okay? Grandpa threw up the whole time. <laughs> How did you meet Dr. Silverman? As you can see, not the same way you did. <laughs> My boyfriend asked me to get them done. But he's oh, not your no. husband? Oh, no, we are not married. And probably never will. I don't think you're going to have a choice real soon. So tell me, Mr. Karpov, how much did you pay? One billion, billion euro. Yeah. Per seat. Per seat. What would you have done if you were rich like me? Okay, guys. The plan is to refuel in Hawaii, so sit down and buckle up. Oh, refuel in Hawaii? Does Hawaii exist? Oh, God. The state of Hawaii. That's a lot of lava. How much fuel do we have left? Not enough. At least we're not going to need the landing gear. What about it? Oh, we lost it all. In Vegas. Yeah, very volcanic. 
that big plane should have plenty of fuel. I mean, first of all, get rid of all the damn cars. That'll lighten your weight, and you can get a lot farther. Hi, Dada. Do you want to speak to my daddy? Yes, please. Who should I say is calling? Tell him it's his father. You're my grandpa? Uh-huh. Yes, sweetheart, I am. Oh, he got a picture of her. Uh-oh. There goes that conversation. He probably thought he hung up on him. Yeah, this is all the ash from the volcano. What, are we letting people into the White House? Sure, why not? Who can help me with missing persons? Uh, sorry, man, I'm really busy right now. Uh, I mean, uh, of course, sir. Sorry, Mr. President. Uh, don't worry about it. You're doing a great job, sir. Oh! Oh, jeez. That's gonna go down. The capital's been hit by 9.4. 9.4? That's a big boy. The Russian president's on the line, sir. That's affirmative, Mr. President. Until communication is restored, I suppose I am in command. Here's oh. that all other heads of state are en route, with the exception of the Italian prime minister. The Italian president also stayed behind. I've been there. I didn't get to be there for very long. Oh, goodness. The Sistine Chapel is going to fall. There it goes. There goes the Pope. If the movement of our land masses comes to a halt, we expect the formation of gigantic tsunamis. Yeah, big tsunamis. Pull up the Japanese seaboard, will you? Yes, sir. We recorded two underwater quakes at 7.9 and 8.2. Yeah, as long as it knows where it's coming from, it should be able to point at that direction a little bit. It might uh, not survive, though. It's a, If it hits it from the side, it's done for. Tony, I was too late. You never know it. Uh, oh, nope, it's on the side of the ship. They're done for. Pointing the wrong way. Yep. It'll just flip it right over. Here comes the water. That's an aircraft carrier. I'm coming home, Dorothy. And there goes the White House. <laughs> Nothing just static. Not even an emergency signal. Can't think about what's going on down there. No, you shouldn't. No. I tried to find our old spot at Yellowstone. I couldn't find it. Do you think people change? But people yeah. do need me. I certainly eat a lot more cereal now. Yep. <laughs> you blocked us out. Do you love him? I love him enough. Enough. You're telling me that the North Pole is now somewhere in Wisconsin? Actually, that's the South Pole now. Oh! Engine failure. Two of the six are down. We must get ready. Better wake up the kids. Are they over land? Why do you hate Gordon? Huh? He hates him. Hey, I don't hate him. Well, you don't like him either. Well, that, yeah, I mean, he gets to spend all the time with you and his wife. You guys would get along really, really well. I like him a lot, huh? I do my best, I promise. Then we gotta land, and uh, it's gonna be a little bumpy and maybe a little wet. I'm telling you, they could have flown so much farther if they would have gotten rid of all those stupid cars. I think you better come up here. It's like the whole world shifted by a thousand miles. Oh, it did! Oh! That's not good. Get in the car. They're taking the cars? Oh. Go. Go. I, you don't have to tell me twice. <laughs> okay. No, no, don't go. We have to wait for him. Uh. Engine. Start. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, okay, well, they're off the plane. Good thing they're off the plane. Hey, the plane landed pretty good. No, he's good. No, he's good. No, he's <laughs> just a pause. Oh, yeah, no, he's gone. <laughs> All the, the writers are like, let's make sure we really kill this guy. <laughs> That's a giraffe. And a rhino. I think they're going to the ark. What color are your passes? I am green card. For my boys and me. 
Oh. Yuri! She's not allowed to go? The thing. I didn't know about you and Sasha. May God bless that poor bastard soul. <laughs> oh, she was cheating on him. I'm Captain Michael, skipper of the American ship. Please accept my sincere condolences for your father. So we have an American ship. My high school career was 2,000 books and zero girlfriends. <laughs> I didn't even kiss a boy till I was in college. What? Okay, are we finally gonna see these arcs? Is that the queen? They're still, they're still working on him. Get back with your other green cards or I'll have you detained. Well, I guess your green card's not worth anything. Over there! Oh, it's the uh, guy with the truck. Oh, he stopped. How are all these people chosen? Looks to me like their checkbooks got him on board. That's right, Dr. Wilson. Without billions of dollars from the private sector, this entire operation would have been impossible. We That's sold true. tickets. Life isn't fair? Is that it? You want to donate your passes to a couple of Chinese workers? You be my guest. He's right. It sucks, but he's correct. They needed the billions of dollars in order to even build the things. Oh, this is the scientist guy, right? Yeah, here comes the water. You could fit 10 people in here. A working phone? We never got picked up, Adrian. Elif never came. Goodbye, my friend. Yeah. So one of the things that he has a problem with is the space, right? Well, it's not about the space. It's about it's about food. It's not about space. Sure, you can fit uh, half a million people on the ship, but you can only feed a hundred thousand of them. Which is from Nampan, oh, bio again. Right More Sony products. Talk to me, Helmsy. When's it gonna hit? Adjust the countdown. Two out. Uh, one hour. An hour and 30 minutes? It's going down really fast. 28 minutes, 28 10 minutes. seconds to impact. Um, time to go. He thinks the world of you, you know that? He's a great little man. They can agree on that, right? I always wanted to have a family of my own. You're a lucky man, Jackson. Please, just take my children. I'm begging you. Please. Oh my God. I'm begging you, please take them. So we are all children of Earth, yeah. Little begging didn't hurt, right? They're opening the mountain! Oh, there you go! Yeah, let's go! It's a big whatever it is. I don't know. It looks more like anchors? a... Yeah. They're spaceships, buddy. Yeah, they're Arcs. a boat. They're the Ark. Look at all the people. The dog can get over there. Yep. <laughs> I like that. We have to stop this madness. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Dr. Adrian Helmsley. I know we've all been forced to make difficult decisions to save our human civilization. There's nothing human and nothing civilized about what we're doing here. Dr. Helmsley's passion it's admirable. We have very limited resources and extreme- Right. It's about food. Look at the clock. We have barely 15 minutes left. Everybody out there has died in vain if we start our future with an act of cruelty. If my father were here, he would open the gates. The people of Russia, along with China and Japan, agree to open the gates. Open the gates. They vote to let these people come in. Well, then hurry up about it. In a few moments, we will open the gates and get you people in. They are opening the gates! Go! Go! Oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Those are bad things! Nope! Okay, he's done. Yeah, Gordon's donezo. Oh! Oh, where's. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're with the old guy on top of the mountain. Yeah. A wave taller than the mountain. Just a reminder that I'm offering a seven-day free trial to new Patreons. That is where you can find all my full reactions and this exclusive content. Well, who are you alerting? Okay, well, the kids are going to get on. Okay, the kid- oh, dad died. 
<laughs> but he saved the kids. Captain, we have a breach in the zoological bay. I know those kids. This is the captain speaking. We expect to be impacted by water shortly. Brace yourself! Coming through, excuse me! What are, you're a scientist. What are you gonna do down the hydraulic area? You got a hole in the back, Cap. Yeah, here comes the water. We can't get there! The rear of the ship is starting to seal itself up one compartment at a time! Yeah! Safety measures. Oh. Yep, that's what ships do. <laughs> that's Air Force One again. Oh, there goes the thing holding the ship. We're gonna hit each other. Oh. I don't think this was a great plan. Are you okay? Try and connect us. It's Adrian Helmsley. We met at Yellowstone. That's great. Open the goddamn door. 29,000 feet. What the hell is it? 29,000 feet. We're headed straight for the north face of Mount Everest, Mr. Anheuser. Oh, great. Everest. There's something blocking the hydraulics. If you can't get it out, none of us are going to make it. I guess you shouldn't have opened the doors. <laughs> I know where it is. I'll give it a try. Dad, we did it. You can help me out the next time. We caused this thing, it was us. Gotta go check it out. Yeah, it's your guys' fault. Oh my God, yeah! Help! She's done for. Press down with your hand. Oh no, the kid's going. Ah. Ah. Now she's gonna go? Distance to impact, 1,850 meters. Oh, here comes the kid. God damn it, I told you to stay up there with mom. Yeah. Would you be pissed at the kid? No, we lost him. You light the way, and I'll go for the cable. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, God. It started. Swim. And John, start the engine. That's a dumb system. You can't start the engine without sealing every single door. Impact 50 meters. Just a little ice. Oh, crap. Reverse motion activated. Oh, it's backing up. They're good. What about John Kuzak? Start sucking out all the water. Please, please, please. He's coming. Oh He's just taking his sweet time. He wanted you to sweat a little. You did it! You did it! Start sucking all that water out. Day 27. Month one, year one. Shuttle Atlantis. Our last day. Sharing our memories, hopes, and ideas. Oh, she's reading his book. Somehow or another, we all have relatives in Wisconsin. The end. And the author's on board. Apart from books and art, do you think there's anything else we might possibly share in the future? Are you asking me out on a date? Yes, I was. At this point in Dr. civilization, to the bridge, please. if you get along, you know, just start procreating. Can I hold him? Sure. He can be your dog, too, if you like. Thanks. Where have you been all my life? Gift shop. Yeah, fresh air is helpful. Just a lot of ocean. Wow, cool doors. This is hard to believe, but the Himalayas are no longer the roof of the world. It's now the Drakensberg Mountains. The entire African continent has risen. Several thousand feet, and it likely never even flooded. Whoa! We've already set course for it. For Africa? Daddy, when will we go back home? I mean, wherever we're all together, that's home. Yeah, true. No more pull-ups. No more pull-ups. Yeah, there's a bunch of land. How welcoming would they be? 
Society lives on. Yeah. Okay, well, let's talk about it. That was 2012, and it was a Patreon poll pick for Blow Stuff Up. And boy, did they. We could say that again. I think it was so much us blowing stuff up as the earth blowing itself up. <laughs> but boy, did it. Um, I only knew three people. I knew John Kuzak. I knew the president who was from Lethal Weapon and Woody Harrelson, which was the nut job on the top of the mountain in Yellowstone. <laughs> so three's pretty good, but I think I'm missing a lot of people from this movie that I should probably know. But all in due time, right? It's only been a couple of years me watching movies, so, you know, we'll get there eventually. I'm sure I'll know who a bunch of these people are. If there's anybody specifically that I should have known in this, please comment below um, and let me know like what I'm missing out on. The, believe it or not, the guy I liked probably not the best. I mean, I really like John Cusack, so, but the guy I liked the best was the, uh, the kind of chubby faced guy that was uh, taking over for the president the whole time. Like, he had very harsh realities to them, but they were pretty clear realities. It's not about how many people you can fit on a ship. It's about how much food, water, nutrients, like, you know, how much you have that can handle the people. You could stick 100,000 people on a boat, but if you only got enough, you know, enough food for 10,000 people, that's that's a problem. That's some serious rationing issues, especially when you have to make it last forever. If there is no land anymore, if there are no trees, there's no fruit, there's nothing. There's nothing of substance. So, yeah. There's just the, like, think of it this way. In order for this to kind of work a little bit, you would have to have livestock on the ship that are, you know, that are making more livestock that you can eat. It's just we're not far enough along in our technological ways to just, like on Star Trek, I think, they just, like, pushed buttons on some, like, council and it just, like, kind of appeared. <laughs> we're not there yet. <laughs> Maybe one day. Oh. Uh, uh. I don't know, maybe. Oh, on uh, on Back to the Future 2, they had like a little itty bitty pizza and they like stuck it in a thing and they just pushed a button. The pizza was like that big. <laughs> it was like a like a maximizer. That'd be good. We wish we should get that. I don't know. What do you think of 2012? I think it was a bit out there as a solution. I don't know. Why pick that very specific place in China? And why stick them so close together that they're going to, like, bonk into each other? Uh, I'm sure there's, like, a million problems with this movie, and I'm just, like, glancing at the top. Most movies always have some kind of problem. There's... My kids told me about one movie I can't remember. They were, like... There's all these, like... There's, like, one scene, it's, like... It's, like, in the... Gosh, I don't know. They said it was, like, in the 80s movie or something. And, like... There's all this modern stuff. It's supposed to be like an older movie, and there's all these like modern things just showing up randomly in the movie. <laughs> oh no. I don't know. Maybe I'll have to ask him what it was that I can find it and watch it. Anyways, uh, let me know what you thought of 2012, and uh, don't forget to subscribe and like. And uh, as always, never forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Okay, bye.